Wins over Port Melbourne and now the joint ladder leaders box here must have the boys uh, now full of confidence. It's always great. It's always great to win games against uh, genuine quality opposition, which with which both of those clubs are. So that um, in a way that drives the boys on to be as good as they possibly can for that week. So if you can if you can put in performances like that, like I said, against good quality opposition, it, it, it's really important to their development. Um, so, yeah, we were pleased with what we've got in the last couple of games, no doubt about it. Again, I think I touched on last week that we, we felt even the Richmond game when we got beaten that uh, we were getting closer to playing the style of footy that we, we think we can play as a group. So last week was a massive step forward and a little bit of confidence came out of that. And for the boys to follow up today and certainly play the style of football that they played in the first half was was outstanding, really. We were, we were wrapped with that. And even... Early in the third quarter when they challenged us a little bit, they kicked a couple of early goals, we were able to bounce back and put the foot down again and, and even it up a bit. So I thought it was a really solid performance across the day. The boys burst out of the blocks real quickly and that ended up being the foundation for the win. How important is it to keep that momentum going in future games? Yeah, well, that's crucial. I mean, you, you, if you could play every game like we did in the first 25 or 30 minutes, you would. Um, but certainly... That's something that we've worked on probably over the last month and that that we were probably a little bit slack on at stages um, early in the season. So, yeah, the effort over the first 25 or 30 minutes to set the game up was, was terrific. We can still be better in some areas, but it was really good today.